everyone in the Better Bones community. Today I want to answer a few questions that you've been sending in. The first question relates to vitamin K2 as MK7. Now this particular person says, look, I want to take natto, which is a fermented soy, which is actually where MK7 first came from. It's a very strong ferment. It's like a, it smells like a very rotten cheese. Not many Americans like it, but natto is great. It will, it will give you lots of MK7, and it's been shown in Japan to be associated with good heart disease, strong bone health. That's natto. MK7 is an extract they made from natto, and now they make it from chickpea. They ferment chickpeas, and then they have MK7. And that is the one of the active ingredients in natto that really helps keep calcium in the bone and keep calcium out of the arteries. And so they are both fine factors to use. There's no problem using them together. In fact, vitamin K is very safe, except if a person were on Coumadin drugs, that's the only exception. So you can use both, natto and MK7 supplements. Most people don't like the natto. We know the effective dose of MK7 is about 200, 180 micrograms. And interesting, I've been talking to the researchers in the Netherlands who are working on this MK7, and they're using a higher dose like 300 milligrams to see if they can reduce arterial calcification. That'll be fascinating. I'll let you know when that research comes through, when it's finalized.